All right, thank you, Tony. Digging out from yet another snowstorm is bad enough, but it's even worse when dealing with today's frigid temperatures and brutal wind chills. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Daly continues our pinpoint weather team coverage live from Woonsocket with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom. Shannon and Mike, we're here in Woonsocket where about eight to ten inches of snow fell. But what also fell is the mercury. And the combination of the snow and this extreme cold is making for quite the challenge. Let the cleanup begin and don't be fooled by the sunshine. It's frigid out here. This is Woonsocket. Meet your neighbors, have some fun. Do something for your neighbor. That's what you like about the snow? Yes. It's it about the neighbors? Together. Yeah. Sometimes you don't see your neighbors for a while, but in the snow, for some reason or other, they come out. See? They're coming out. Read any good thermometers lately? Check this. Eight degrees, and people are still out shoveling. It's really cold. You say it's really cold, and yes, I'm looking at you. Yeah. Sorry, but where is your hat? I don't use to it, you know? My wife always, you know, begging me to do hats. I don't use to it, you know? Here's an important reminder after a snowstorm. If you've got a fire hydrant in your area, shovel it out. You've had enough already? I have. Yep. That didn't take long. Get ready for spring now. You're done with winter already. I it's am. only January. I know, but I can't wait for February and March to come. Maybe we can get better weather. He thinks he had it bad being out shoveling for a bit, but we caught up with plenty of people who had it much worse. They were out working all day in this cold. We'll hear from them new at 6. Live in Woonsocket with the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.